it was uh, 1974. Uh, we settled back here in the house. My aunt was sitting at the kitchen table and said, Cornelia, what are you doing? Oh, I really don't quite know. Up to now, I've just done many playgrounds and a few things here and there. Oh, you should do big things, she said. The telephone rings. Bing Tom on the other line said, Cornelia, could you come to Arthur's office? We'd like you to see the three block project. That was Robson Square. So I said I'd be glad to come. I bustled down to the office. Uh, Bing and Arthur talked to me and showed me a maquette, uh, which uh, was a vague kind of a thing. And they said they might like a roof garden there. And uh, it was supposed to have been a 55-story high rise, but Arthur laid it on its side, and so it could be a park. I said that would be great and would be so meaningful to the city and so forth. So Bing concludes and says, by tomorrow morning at 10 o'clock, you bring me what you think it should be. Oh, my goodness. I wrote a two-page memo saying it must be, if it's a roof garden, it must be accessible for everyone from zero to 80. It must be fun throughout the seasons. It must have light, lighting to attract people. But most of all, it was important to study the weight on the roof, introduce not soil, but a growing medium, address drainage, waterproofing, and all these things. And how did I know all this? That is the most peculiar thing. I read the California Soils Handbook, in which it spelled out lightweight growing medium and all sorts of things like that. So I brought that to Bing at 10 o'clock, as appointed. And an hour later, I had a telephone call, when can you start to work?